Had you done wholesaling before? Was there already wholesaling in the business? Because I, I just realized I've never really yeah. looked into whole, wholesaling and what that entails. So if you, could you tell me more about how that works? Yeah, a lot of a lot of artists will ask me about that because that's kind of the thing. It's 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 almost a very separate type yeah. of business, right? You know, because selling a one off of something, uh, but then duplicating it. So it'd be sort of like if you did. And a piece of artwork and then you had it printed and you did then you did 300 of them and then you took those and you took them to an art gallery and said hey I'll give you this for nine dollars and then they sell it for 18 mm-hmm. so that's what I do but with earrings so you know I come up with a really cool concept and then I make um, several hundred of them yeah and so that's what I liked about the business too because they already had these accounts at Whole Foods and um you know hundreds of other stores around the country like gift shops and stuff so they already had those accounts and i had experience selling to wholesale accounts too so for me it was a very easy fit okay. because i understood the business it was a great concept i i could easily um just i easily just stepped in and kind of you know took it over and and i also just find it really fun and interesting too. I get to talk to new people every day, you know, around the country. I get to go and sit in a studio and do some design. I get to sit and just relax and make earrings. So it gives me a little bit, you know, I do some social media, um, you know, sales calls, you name it, Mm -hmm. you know, variety of things. So if you didn't have those wholesale uh, things set up when you bought the business, like what are some, cause you said you had done it before. What are some ways that people, like if people wanted to know about wholesaling, like how would you advise that they even go about it? Like what are some tips I suppose? Cause I'm, I'm really um, curious to see how this works. Like, I mean, you already had it in place, but it's like, yeah, yeah but how? <laughs> well, I was, I was actually just talking to a friend that I had met at a trade show in Ohio and I was talking to her on the phone and, um, and she, ha- she has a jewelry business too. And so she was saying to me, like, like, I don't know how to get started. Do I just walk into a store and what if I go to a store and they already have a bunch of jewelry? And I said, well, um, the best way to look at it is when you go into a store look around and see what they have and see if they have a, a hole in what they're not selling. Okay. So say you go into a store and I could probably do it something more related to what you do. Like say they sell um, collectibles, mm-hmm. but they, but they don't have any collectibles of like um, superheroes, okay. you know, yeah. they're, they're missing that. And that's something that you sell then you, that's a great way to pitch the store. Be like, Hey, you know, I'm making all these, um, soup. I have all these superheroes and I'm doing, um, I have a whole collection and I can sell you for them for a better price and like wholesale them to you. And then you could sell them for a different price. So it'd be, so, so that's how I would look at it. That's how I would start. Okay. Um, the other good way to start is to, if you say you, um, you were an artist doing, you know, creating paintings and, and you had five paintings that you, or the style that you kept doing and people really loved it. Um, I would take the top five sellers and then maybe take those and print them on a, a um, note card, you know, and then sell it to a store that way, because then at least, you know, like people really love that style that you're doing. And Mm -hmm. so there's a, and so you can tell if there's a market for it, right? Mm-hmm. And so, because the problem is you really don't want to invest a lot of time and energy in a product that where it doesn't have any traction in the market, right? So you mm-hmm. kind of want to test it, right? And see, so you could even do that by making just three copies of something and selling it to that store and seeing if it sells well. So that's kind of the, that's the simplest way to get into wholesaling, yeah. you know, you could also work with um, getting a sales rep too. And somebody who goes out and tries to find you accounts, or you could go to a trade show. Yeah. And so, well, and you now could. you used to be able to go to a trade show. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, now they, they do have virtual trade shows. And so I'll be doing, I've done a couple of, well, I haven't, I've done a couple virtual like gift shows. And so 
I'm going to do a trade show soon. Um, really? Where have you done those at? Yeah. So there was one. Um, I'm part of the Wisconsin Women's um, Business Association. Okay. And they had like a holiday virtual show because they usually have um, a holiday event every year where people can come together and kind of, you know, celebrate each other and um, in all the work that the organization has done. So instead they did it all online Mm -hmm. and then they had a little shopping um, trade show kind of thing after. And that was so fun. And then, and people, it's like this where you're on a video and people come into your store and then you can talk to them. What platform was it on? It was a whole separate platform oh. for virtual shopping. Yeah. Okay. I can't I can't remember the name. It, I always wonder too, when you said people could come into your store, it, you made me think, and I'm wondering if anybody did this, but if you were doing it on mobile, you could actually be in your store. And if somebody popped up on the video, you could actually walk them around like they're in your yeah. store, right? Yeah, that's true. Uh, that's true. That just, yeah. that just occurred to me. I don't know if anybody did that or not, but I'm like, that's what I would do. Yeah. Um, <laughs> The future is here. (laughs) Exactly. (laughs) 